Howdy and hello, I'm Doe. Hope you're doing good. And I'll try to explain why PS5 is destroying the balance in Helldivers 2 because of a certain bug. This is making it so Battle Titans take way more damage than they ever should, at least as far as I can tell. And also led to the nerf of the railgun, as far as I can assume. Before going into detail, I have two questions. Do you normally two-shot Battle Titans? And if so, do you think it makes sense you can two-shot Battle Titans using probably around 78, 80% charge, just above safe, to the face, no weak spot needed, versus barely stripping Charger's armor on their leg in about a dang near full saw shot? You gotta hit them with a 90% plus. It has to change colors when you're charging it. You're almost committing the Sudoku explosion. Does it make sense? You can merc an elite barely trying but you can barely you can maim a heavy when you're trying to not combust food for thought anywho the bug for ps5 players that lets them let other people one shot or two shot is just being in their party when i play solo it takes me around 20 shots if i'm just shooting the face and not really trying that hard around 23 to be exact using really high charge i know how the gun works I make guides on the game for Lord's sake, and I also I can two shot charger armor. I know I know how to charge a shot. Before the update, it took about ten if I wasn't trying that hard, if I was just aiming for the face, just testing it. Six if aiming for the weak spot, if that even exists. Maybe placebo, who knows? So the damage changed, and keep that in mind too for a later thing I'll be reading from the CEO of Arrowhead. But when I get a PS5 player in my party. I can two shot them barely even trying anything pre patch it would be a safe shot two safe shots to the face no weak spot needed i would put down a battle titan consistently it was no every now and again sometimes you know maybe once in a blue moon it was every single time now all i have to do is go a smidge above safe because you need the armor pin and the same thing happens only if i have a ps5 player in my party and yesterday, I had the most crazy thing happen. I joined a lobby because I'm out here searching for PS5 players. I won't join your lobby unless you have underscores and numbers in your name. Those are usually clear signs of PS5 player. I'm going to take the advantage. And I'm playing with these folks. We're just, you know, gaming. We're on the uh, defense missions where a bunch of things spawn around the base where you're evacuating civilians. And I'm murking these battle titans. And I noticed myself, I just have to hit them with the freaking weakest, the most faint charge above safe and i'm putting them down and i'm like it still works we still have the ps5 bug in full effect at least i do and then i do that for a while lo and behold everyone either leaves the game or dcs i'm not sure what happened those missions are normally just an absolute slaughter fest anyway the moment they all leave the ps5 players are gone too i can no longer two shot I think the Bile Titan that was still alive at the time maybe had extra damage being taken, but the ones that came after it, no. No, 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 no. Those took, I think I only shot like six times, but still, I, I went from freaking barely above safe, consistently two tapping Bile Titans to taking six plus to not even kill it. Kind of peculiar, a wee bit perplexing even, considering I play with crossplay off and I couldn't two shot for the life of me. It was like a seven shot or something like that, even higher, and they probably got damaged by my teammates as well. I even asked folks with cool accents what was going on. Do you often two shot Battle Titans? If with you like... play with PlayStation. They have the same conclusion as I do. It's weird and it can't be a skill issue. How could I, the same person showing you all this gameplay, go from two tapping consistently using Freaking Mamby Pamby Delamby Winnie Hut Junior Deluxe Edition Five Charge, the weakest you can really do, basically, and two tapping them before the patch. Safe mode, two tap consistently. After the patch, just above safe mode, two tap consistently. I think it's like maybe around eighty percent. I don't know the exact numbers, but it's nowhere near what I have to do solo to twenty three tap. And I'm not aiming for the weak spot. I had to make that so abundantly clear to folks. They, they just, they run with random assumptions, even though I'm showing them exactly what's happening. I don't have enough crayons to draw the picture that some of y'all need. And it's not the aim assist either, because if, if you don't know, you get aim assist when you're playing on a controller, I believe. And it's rotational aim assist, which is not, it's not slow down. It's different. I don't care in this kind of game, but I don't, I'm not seeing that happen to me when I'm playing on mouse and keyboard because I've tried to control it a little bit and you can kind of tell when the circle is going crazy and trying to target certain things for you. 
I just have the regular sway. It's moving on its own because we have sway. It's doing its own thing. It's to simulate the inaccuracy when you're not aimed in or steadied, down, steadied by being prone or crouching. Cool. Even when I focus the weak spots, though, and I'm crouching, crouching and going and laying down to hit the shots I need to hit to be as pre precise as I can, it's not a two-shot, even with the max charge. Post, pre-patch, doesn't matter. So for me, the current assumption I have is that me playing the PS5 player for sure is the only way I can two-shot ball titans that are full HP using very weak charge, which is wild. And it could just be crossplay, because I assume that PS5 players can also do the one-shot, but from my testing, the PS5 player being the host and me being, and me being their lobby, they could not two-shot ball titans. I could. Them being in my party, I haven't tried it if I'm the host, but... I feel as though if you have one PS5 player, they can't two-shot. Maybe having two PS5 players, they both give each other the buff. I don't know. I don't have PS5. I can't test it. PlayStation, if you gave me one, I could. And we could solve a big problem in Hell Divers 2 community, I'm just saying. Or just sponsor me because times are tough these days, bro. What can I say? I have tried to contact the CEO of Arrowhead and creative director of Hell Divers 2, Mr. Piles. And this is what they said about this on the 8th. The road gun in unsafe mode didn't change the capabilities of it as it should. The armor pin of it was insanely tweaked and now goes from being good to being goaded. Good in safe mode, goaded in unsafe. Before it was just the craziest even in safe mode. Like it was always intended to be. A risk slash reward weapon for high tier play. Like a sniper rifle on crack but with the risk of killing the user. This wasn't towards my response but just what they said about the gun in general. Which isn't, it's like, it's, it's not accurate because it did change damage wise. For me on PC, it now takes twice as many shots, if not quadruple as many shots, than it did before. And then we scroll down here, I said some gibberish. It did change. It now takes 20 plus railgun shots, blah, 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 blah. You get the deal. And then folks respond to that with, turn on safe mode then. This is on safe mode, LMAO. Because I get these comments all the time, they drive me nuts. Skill issue then. I'm going to make a whole video discussing that the folks that say skill issue like that are the worst at video games. It's not even a contest, and I feel abysmally sorry for them, but that's for another time. I attached a video with some slight editing to explain what's happening, and I also put some feedback for other stuff like the recent stealth AI change that I find to be uh, interesting, to say the least. But hopefully it gets seen. I kind of doubt it will, just because Twitter don't like me, man. They don't push my stuff at all. For anyone that wants to try it themselves, go ahead and queue into level 4 Bile Titans, which level does not change the damage you deal or take, or the damage that monsters deal or take. It's just more consistent this way. They're in a place that they, they spawn at, and they don't get damaged by other monsters, at least until you get there and other monsters run into them. So this is what it looks like, little freaking Bile Titan icon. There used to be a dual hunt that they removed without saying anything, I believe. And I'm not, like, why? Why would you remove that? It was fun. And yeah, you just test it on that. Invite your friends that are different consoles, see how it goes, play it solo, see how it goes, turn off crossplay, see how it goes. Try it if you don't believe me, and you may get different results. Some folks say that they can two-shot Battle Titans on PC, crossplay turned off, playing solo. I can't. I would I would have gotten lucky by now and done, and done it. I simply can't. There is no, just shoot this weak spot. It'll make it so easy. I've shot him in the weak spot like a thousand times before. Like around six. Pre-patch. Post-patch, I haven't tried it. I don't really plan to. It's just, I'm, with a PS5 player, I can shoot them in the face with basic low charge and they get destroyed. That is the main point I'm trying to drive home here. With no PS5 player, I can't do that. That is all. And it applies to more than just a railgun. It applies to the arc thrower and possibly other weapons as well. I might try that, test it out, see what's going down. We'll see. And I guess final remarks. This needs to get fixed. There's no point in trying to balance the game when this exists to the point that I can't play these guns solo anymore. I cannot use railgun against bugs and have a good time because now it takes a year and a day to break charger legs. I don't hate the idea of it. It takes too much though. And Battle Titans, it's going to take me two clips, basically. More than a full clip. At least half a clip. And given the current spawn rage, which I think are fine, just tone down the AI. Why do you guys make it insane? And it's not taking shots at anybody. It's just, it is frustrating that we, that y'all stealth changed all these things while also making us weaker. You made everything else in the game stronger while making us weaker. That doesn't feel good at all.
and the changes are just inherently bad. The railgun change as a concept is a good one. I think it makes sense to make it to where you can't just play on unsafe mode, or you can't play on safe mode and do insane damage all the time. I think unsafe mode is where you should get most of your damage from. That I'm cool with. It needs more tweaking though, and it'll it'll get changes hopefully. But the other stuff that was unchanged, or that change that y'all didn't mention in the patch notes, that's a little messed up. I'm going to be completely honest, and I will cover it because it's a lot of stuff, and it should be talked about. Anywho, that's the video. Hopefully it helped you in some way. If it did, awesome. If it didn't, I'm sorry. I'll try to get harder next time, maybe. And have a good day. Thanks for watching. Peace.